A local government body is setting up to take on an international issue tomorrow. The St. Louis County Board of Commissioners is expected to vote on a resolution regarding refugees and whether they'll be allowed to live within the county's borders. CBS 3's Ryan Campo has details on the resolution and what a vote means going forward. It's an issue now in the hands of states and counties across the country. We're basically giving them a chance at life. I mean, without letting refugees come into other countries, we're serving them a death sentence. And it all stems from an executive order President Donald Trump issued back in September. It says counties and states are now required to provide written consent stating their willingness to accept refugees for resettlement. And Tuesday morning, St. Louis County commissioners will vote on exactly that. Commissioner Beth Olson says she supports keeping the county's borders open. St. Louis County is open for business and open for, for new people, that our small towns are in need of young new people coming in that will be entrepreneurs, and our, and our city is uh, welcome for more diversity. Olson says she has gotten feedback from concerned citizens. People are afraid that more crime will be coming with refugees and more, you know, will exhaust all of our public health and human services um, budgets. And, you know, we really haven't seen that that is the case as refugees have been resettled in other areas in Minnesota. And so I think um, that that fear um, is, is tragic to me. We reached out to other commissioners for their opinion, but did not hear back. However, as reported by the Duluth News Tribune, Commissioner Keith Nelson weighed in during a December board meeting. He says he has some funding-related questions he wanted answered before voting Tuesday morning. Olson says in the last six years, no refugees have been placed in St. Louis County. Instead, they largely are placed in the Twin Cities. That's because they are required to live within 50 miles of the refugee resettlement agencies located there. Now, because St. Louis County does not have a similar agency, only people with family members living here can be placed in the county.